Subscriber alert, subscriber alert. Your friendly neighborhood YouTubers rated A for awesome. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you, and you're welcome. Enjoy. Check me out on all major social media platforms. Instagram, TikTok, Macari, and Facebook. Ow! See you there, babies. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the show. All right, guys. So today we're going to be doing a little uh, review of my custom Spawn on Throne. This is kind of like the second time I'm doing this video. Um, somewhat. I revamped my Spawn, spawn on Throne. Um, so I'm going to show you guys what I did. So when I first did this custom, a lot of you guys didn't seem to like my Spawn on Throne. <laughs> Um, when I first got to Spawn on Throne, I customized them. So uh, today we're going to take a look at something a little bit different. So I added a bunch of detail, other stuff I added to this guy just to make him look more badassery. So um, I'm going to uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to leave him on the stand. We're going to do some close ups here. I'm going to show you guys what the hell I did. So obviously you can see what I did. Well, actually, we'll stop this for a moment so I can show you guys what I did. Um, so if you guys watched my um, my review of Spawn on Throne, um, I essentially painted his entire throne. Um, instead, I decided to put my custom commando spawn on the throne because I felt like he just looks a whole lot better. And plus, he does not have a cape. So therefore, he just looks a whole lot better, you know, with the mask on and... Um, with, and he's able to sit down as well on the throne. Uh, if you're looking, uh, I added a skull right here. I glued to his chair. Um, of course, if you guys saw my review of the spawn throne, or sp uh, commando spawn, then you guys know what the hell I did. Uh, I gave him a sword. This sword is actually a Frankenstein from Frankenstein, DC's Frankenstein. I thought it went very, very well with him. Just added some blood to it uh i gave him one of the guns from nightmare spawn right there just added a little a dark dry wash over it right there um i put like a little skeleton like demon hanging out by spawn all the little green stuff kind of like his uh necroplasm i think it goes very very well adds a lot of color uh to the background you know on his throne right there as if he's bleeding or if he killed somebody you know, with the necroplasm blood right there. And also the blood as well on the throne, all over the throne. Uh, come up to the top, I end up putting a crow on top of the throne. I end up super gluing him onto the top of the throne right there. And then you turn around to the back. Um, I added the cape simply because if you guys look at the throne right here, it already has the cape right there, but there's no cape on him. So I wanted to add this cape to him and i got this from my buddy at nerd cape nerds if he's watching probably not um so the cape didn't really go well with um uh, my uh with the any spawn figure because it was just kind of too bulky you know what i mean so i just ended up putting it up on the back of the throne and just wrapping chains around it i felt like it gave a lot more textured layer look to the throne and it was kind of perfect you know what i mean for this throne figure there's the top right there there's the crow sitting on top of it on the throne and yeah, putting the crow on top of the throne, I thought was a really, really good idea. Um, and then you turn it around or it goes well, that way. It doesn't matter. <laughs> and so, yeah, the 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 cape himself looks like it's, you know, um, has the throne like wrapped up. You know what I mean? Wrapped up in the throne. And I kind of like that idea a lot. Like the cape is the character unto itself. And then you turn around, there's the blood on the sword right there. There's the side piece. There's some of the chain that came with the cape that I got from my buddy at Nerd Cape Nerds right there. Um, 
turned out very, very well. And then some of the uh, paint that I just threw onto the throne right there just makes this makes it pop. You know what I mean? And then turn around here. There's the cape right there. There's the cape. And also one of the main reasons why I decided to throw this cape onto there. Well, uh, I would like to thank my dog uh, for helping me uh, decide this option because uh, she got a hold of the cape and she started chewing on it. Uh, so I'm like, all right, what am I going to do with the cape? So I decided just to throw it onto the throne. Um, and then we turn back around right here. There's no point in me taking off the spawn to show you guys. I already did a review of commando spawn, this commando spawn. Um, so if you guys want to take a look at my review, then go ahead and check it out. I end up taking, I actually end up doing a bunch of custom kit bashes. So I end up buying the commando spawn body putting this head sculpt onto this spawn right here. Uh, even though I feel like this one probably can go on to that head sculpt right there and it just look just as good, you know what I mean? But I kind of wanted him to have, like, I wanted him to be, like, maskless commando spawn vibe, you know what I mean? Um, and I wanted him to still have the scarf as well, and I wanted him to have the weapons and the gun, you know, kind of like spawn. Uh, and if you guys didn't see my last review... Uh, I'm going to do a follow-up right here. Uh, here is my um, King Spawn right here. My King Spawn right here. And then I end up throwing some red onto his cape right there. Red and silver. Not cape, but his wings. Red and silver onto his, onto his wings right there. Just to give it a little bit more color. A little bit more vibrantness. Right there. Just wanted to throw some red onto the wings of, of uh, King Spawn. And uh, yeah, he turned out very, very well. Um, so yeah, this is how I'm going to have him displayed now. Um, if you're asking me where I got these items, the skull I just had. Uh, same thing with this guy. I believe he's from another Spawn character in the Crow. I believe I got him from, I don't know, maybe the Crow action figure or one of the... Well, some action figure. So if you're wondering where I got those from, uh, it's just kind of a combination of a lot of things. So... All right, guys, uh, if you tuned in for this little review of, uh, um, I guess, Spawn on Throne, custom commando Spawn on Throne, <laughs> I don't know what to call call this guy. Uh, I just kind of been having fun and uh, doing a lot of mixed matches with a lot of uh, my custom figs. And uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Let me know what you make of my custom commando, thro custom commando Spawn on Throne. Holy crap, man. That's a mouthful. Uh, all right. Uh, I just want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next review. Thanks. Bye.